Good day, RK Figs here. So, you're left with a bunch of cuttings that you got from either your trees or from various places, and you want to know what to do with them. Well, you're in luck, because I'm about to show you what I did with mine. I had a raised bed outside, and even though I knew it was too cold to root these cuttings outside, what I did is, I brought this raised bed into my garage and put a heat pad underneath it. Then, I labeled and shoved all my cuttings in it without even wrapping each cutting in parafilm like I do when I root indoors. I wrapped the whole thing with shrink wrap. This is the stuff they use for wrapping pallets for shipping. Between the heat pad on the bottom and the shrink wrap over the cuttings, it created a humid enough environment to get everything to root and start growing. Then I started making little holes in the shrink wrap to gradually acclimate everything to the less humid environment outside. Some of them didn't like it much, but most of the other ones did really well and grew right through the holes. As the days continued, I kept making the holes bigger and bigger until all the growing cuttings were growing right through the holes. The safest thing to do here is to keep everything in here until the fall when everything goes dormant and then you can cut them out and pot them as individual plants. But I think you would be okay in about a month or two after this stage. This is definitely better than letting those cuttings rot away and then having to throw them in the garbage. So that's a fun little project for you if you have any leftover cuttings. Or maybe you have a friend that has some leftover cuttings. Please don't hesitate to share this video with them. And also, don't forget to hit the like icon down there and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that already. And click that bell icon. This way you can be notified of any future videos. I have some really interesting content coming up in the coming months. We'll see you next time.